Hello and welcome to the second video of PLC Training Center Tutorial. In this video, I will explain how we build this wiring diagram and how we can use it. I, I use uh, the C Electrical CAD software. There is the many CAD software you can use, but uh, I use this one. Okay, you can search and Google about many other uh, software maybe there are easier from this one or maybe this easier from the others so uh, I uh, design some cover and some uh, circuit diagram like that uh, you can google it and watch on YouTube some video if you want to learn this uh, software and about the installation and about the uh, panel so I will explain them in the uh, as the PDF file instead of this software because the PDF more reliable so the first page about the uh, training center or the logo or something uh, some information there are control unit one and for uh, ladder control unit two for mod bus control unit three for PID tuning and uh, HMI and wiring diagram so you must learn five things in this project uh, this uh, link for the first link for the code and the second link for my account on the project hub okay in the next page you can find the plug I use AC power to power up this device and you have X00 in X00 there uh, this is uh, I, I will show you better show you the re real real uh, project okay so we have x00 for the AC power this is the x00 okay and every line is indicated we have a circuit switch Siemens B6 or F1 so this is the F1 the main switch okay this is the F1 and uh, this page is called main switch or MS so this location is MS this location belong to the main switch okay this circuit circuit breaker uh, another page belong to the power supply so PS for location and power supply for explain power supply you can uh, you have G1 and G2 G1 for the power supply G2 2 for the fan and this power supply give us 5 volts DC and 12 volts DC and the ground uh, work on one phase uh, AC okay we have 220 volt AC can check uh, G1 for power, su su power supply and G2 for the uh, fan okay then we have F2 and 3 and 4 F2 for 5 volt volt DC and F3 uh, for 12 volt DC and F4 for uh, 220 volt AC for indicator or for relay so we have F2 F3 and F4 you can check here uh, this photo maybe this photo uh, I have no tag for this F so this F2 this F3 and we have F4 here uh, this image may be old but we have F4 here 
for this relay for this two relay so the F4 isolate this two relay from AC okay then we have CU1 uh, sorry K1 this this K1 uh, used for four relay module for control unit one relay module so we connect on normally open and they all go to X1 okay coming from control unit one A0 1 2 3 so we uh, we connect on analog this is for power the module uh, this module K1 this all beginning with K1 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 okay K1 1 2 3 4 this is for K1 and this is for K2 for control unit 2 this all connected on normally closed okay and then we have CU1 CU1 for control unit 1 Arduino Uno is programmed with ladder so according to this wiring we have this six input from contact or from the push button and have this four output for uh, uh, for uh, relay okay so uh, control unit one and this is the control unit one CU one then we have CU2 control unit 2 okay this is the Ethernet shield this is the cable A1 and this is the wiring for control unit 2 this is the LCD and this is the uh, LCD brightness for brightness purpose for LCD so this is control unit 2 this is the shield this is the mega and the LCD and that's it for this page another page for control unit 3 also I have only one LCD control unit 3 one LCD after that you can go to the, A, to the terminal so, so the first terminal is X1 in X1 I explain all connection all push button or indicator you can go to X1 this is X1 every single uh, contact every single terminal you know about it this is input this is output this is AC this is DC also for X2 X3 and X4 X4 we have the LED and LDR this is X1, X2 and X3 for control unit 2 and X4 for control unit 3 and we have all of the panel or the structure design F1, F2, F3 so any tag you need you can find it here you can search about the K2 or go to, go to page for X4 like that this is this full structure and this structure for the PLC panel okay PLC panel this one or PLC panel PLC panel this one second one for the uh, Modbus panel this this panel and third one for PID panel then uh, at the end we have control unit 2 LCD and what what will show for us and control unit 3 LCD okay this is control unit 2 LCD and control unit 3 LCD okay that's it about the wiring diagram so you can build like this system according to the to wiring diagram or you can change any other things for this device so in next video 
we will show you how you can uh, do logic diagram uh, ladder diagram for the control unit one and which software we use thank you